السلام عليكم وبركاته ون سامي ديزيت رياكشن باك ويد ادر رياكشن يو لافرز ماش باتن سبسكرايب تو نوتيفيكيشن اون جيم ان لاو ذات اول اي نيد ماي نيم از سيمين ام فروم ار جي ام ميدل ايست جوجل تي وي نوت ماي تويتر ماي انستغرام ميت سي فولو مي فري جيم ان لاو ذات اول اي نيد اي كام ان ويد 10 اوسم سين اباوت اندونيسيا لاف فروم ارجيريا تو اندونيسيا اي لاف اندونيسيا ا لوت اند اي لوف اي لوف اي لوف اندونيسيا ا لوت Oh my God! I, I said two times. This, this like, 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 like um, wrong with me. It's coming. Ten awesome things about Indonesia. Okay. Wow! 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 Oh my God! Look As at this. As an American, I knew nothing about Indonesia, but I moved to Singapore for work and have lived there for over six years. This has enabled me to make so many Indonesian friends and visit the country multiple times. So beautiful. I've now visited over 17 islands in Indonesia. Yeah. And I only have 17,491 islands left to visit. But anyways, I discovered Indonesia to be an amazing place that I knew nothing about. And so that's why I made this video. <sighs> oh my God. This crazy. Look at this. Number 10, amazing hidden sites. See, as you travel Indonesia, you'll come across some unusual and really cool sites that you're not going to really read about in guidebooks. For example, I saw a boat that was on top of a home. This was because of a huge tsunami that hit Indonesia and carried the boat on top of a home. But the good side of the story was that it saved 59 lives by people being able to crawl into the boat when water was rising. And my most liked photo on Instagram is a place that you're probably not going to see on many Instagram because almost nobody knows about it. See, I wouldn't have even known about the spot, but my local friends took me there and we were the only ones there on a swing that overlooked this beautiful valley. And these are just a small selection of the many incredible sites you will find in Indonesia. This lie, oh my god, look at this heart. It is locked to lock to this heart. Oh my god, this is so beautiful. <laughs> oh my god. Number nine, Backpacker Haven. Indonesia not only is a gorgeous place, but it's also extremely affordable, making it ideal as a backpacker destination. It's unbelievable, but you can get hostels for two dollars a night. Unreal. And food, clothing, and taxis are incredibly affordable as well. Wow. You can rent a scooter and travel anywhere you want. So Indonesia is a great budget destination. Indonesia is so pretty. Wow. You got your touristy photo spot right here with this chair. Wow. Number eight, people are incredibly friendly. As I walk the streets, people are always saying hi, reaching out to me, telling me to come join them in their activities. You just don't have these things in so many places in this world, but in Indonesia, people literally went out of the way to talk to me and to welcome me into whatever activity they were doing. And it's not just average people on the street, it's celebrities too. I happened to meet Captain Vincent, who is actually the most subscribed to YouTube pilot in the entire world. And he was the most humble and down-to-earth guy. When I came to Jakarta for a layover, he offered his place to let me stay. And we went jamming out, playing music. And we are still good friends. And so regardless if wow. you're an average guy on the street or a celebrity, everybody in Indonesia is friendly and kind. So beautiful. Kind people, mashallah. Nobody rips you up. Not only is Indonesia affordable, but the locals will charge you a fair price. And if you haven't traveled around the world, most places that are very affordable, when they see that you're a foreigner, they'll immediately rise the price. Number six, Komodo dragons. Indonesia is the only place in the world where you can see Komodo dragons in the wild. And Indonesia is so amazing that when you sign up and pay to see the Komodo dragons, they'll also throw in swimming with the manta rays for no additional cost. 
that also throw in hiking on one of the prettiest islands in the entire world. Any one of these three activities would have been my highlight of the year, and yet I did all three in one day in Indonesia. Wow. Indonesia has over 17,000 islands. Oh my god, that's in Indonesia an also has some 17,000 islands. So as you can probably Ooh. imagine, Indonesia also has some of the prettiest beaches in the entire world. Thousands. Seven. Oh my god. Number four, green country. Indonesia is one of the greenest countries in the entire world with the third largest tropical forest in the entire world. Dating can be rough. As a guy, you're often expected to take the woman to a fancy dinner or bar and spend a significant amount of money. But welcome to Indonesia. I don't know why, but Indonesia, they like to go to dates at the mall, which is not... The mall, <laughs> yes. So yeah, go to Indonesia and have a mall date. Number mall two, date. scuba diving. Indonesia has some of the most incredible underwater wildlife you will ever see in your life. Again, with so many incredible islands, you could spend a lifetime and not even touch the surface of all the amazing diving spots there wow. are in Indonesia. I'm incredible. Incredible. Unbelievable. So Jamil Giden. So beautiful. The number one reason to visit Indonesia is diversity. See, when you think of Indonesia, you probably don't think of diversity because it's over 87% Muslim. And those that aren't Muslim, you probably think are ignored or treated unfairly. But that's not true at all. Just look at Bali. No, not the party scene. The fact that 83% of Bali is Hindu. They have temples throughout Bali. And the Indonesian government supports the Balinese in their beliefs. And did you know that the largest Buddhist temple in the entire world is actually in Indonesia? I happened to visit Indonesia at a time when things were happening in Myanmar, so a lot of Buddhists and Muslims weren't really getting along. And so, Indonesian government went out of their way to make sure all their Buddhist citizens were safe. And throughout my entire time of visiting Indonesia, I can't believe how many times I saw people from different religious backgrounds all getting along. It was incredibly beautiful, especially in today's world where there's so much religious conflict. To go to Indonesia and to see these different religions all being friends and getting along beautifully, it was wonderful to see. And so those are my top 10 reasons why you need to visit Indonesia. I will, yo, bro. I will, yo. I will uh, visit Indonesia, yo. This, like, make me be like, I want to visit Indonesia. So beautiful. Oh, my God. If you love my reaction, if you love my face, smash a button, subscribe, notification on, and give me love, and uh, that's all I need. And see you in next video, inshallah. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for comment. Thank you for like and everything. And see you in next video, inshallah.